All right, g'day everyone. Matt and Holly here. Hello, how you it going? It has been a while. It's been a long time since we've been on YouTube and done anything. Yeah. Uh, we thought we'd just do a quick video, just give you guys an update on what the hell we're doing and why we've been absent from YouTube for a while, and then just a bit of an update and uh, yeah, what we can what we can look forward to in the future. <laughs> At the moment, so this truck. Yeah, sorry, we're in uh, Richmond in outback Queensland at the moment. We don't have Elsie here. We're actually on a job for a bit of tourism work around here, doing photos and videos. So we're in Richmond in outback Queensland. We're doing an outback loop, yeah. Cairns loop. Uh, those videos will be up, but they'll be similar to the van videos we did a little while ago. Yeah. So that'll explain the road trains driving past. The yeah. Van park here, <laughs> if, um, if you hear that. So sorry about the traffic. Ah, uh, so yeah. What have we been up to, Hull? For the past couple of months, we obviously did the work with Drive North Queensland in February with the van. We did a bit of van life, which was fun. Um, we did like the van. We thought it would be good for East Coast travel, but it did limit you where you could go on dirt roads, no four-wheel driving, etc. Um, this time around, that was in February, we're now in May, we are back up in Queensland doing the last bit of work for Drive North Queensland. We now have a Prado to do this Outback Loop and the Cairns Loop that Matt was talking about, the Prado's been fantastic. Again, it's just given us a bit more freedom being able to do some dirt roads, but it, yeah, it's good, it's comfortable, so, so comfortable. Yeah, it's a really nice car actually Yeah, <laughs> to drive and around in. Other than this kind of travel stuff, we've been really getting into our weddings, so we've done quite a few wedding films um, since yeah. March. With our other business, yeah. Alt Media, and that's been going really, really well. Really good mm. for our business and our, our goals in life, I suppose. Mm. Um, obviously, Holly and I are at the stage of life now, we want to buy a house. Yeah. Um, you know, I want to sort of do, tick those things off the list and sort of set up a bit of a nest egg. And doing that, uh, YouTube isn't the best um, when it comes to actually making any money. Yeah. <laughs> so actually <laughs> having <laughs> actually having a business, um, you know, bread and butter business on the side has been really good. So yeah, check out some of those videos if you hadn't seen them and you're interested in wedding videos. They're a yeah. bit different so to our usual have, stuff. But... Yeah, we have our Instagram, which is olt.media. We also have a website and stuff. So yeah, it's all up there. Feel free to check it out if you're interested. Yeah, they've been great. Yeah. They've been really good fun. They have been a lot of fun. I, I think I really like them is we have creative freedom with yeah. wedding films and we don't want to do your like slow, slow um, B-roll montage of a wedding day. We want to add personality into it of the couples and tell their story a little story. bit. So yeah, they've and, been good uh, fun. And it was amazing. The YouTube videos that we've done over the past couple of years have pretty much just prepped us for it. Because they're a pretty stressful day and <laughs> yeah. you know, you're charging a lot of money and you've got to get it right. So it's been um, it's been really good, and it's good that we can sort of transfer our skills that we've learned over the past couple of years yeah. into something else and make a living out of it. So yeah. it's been fantastic. So what is next for the channel? We have bought a new car. Uh, it is on its way. Fingers crossed, mid June. Mm -hmm. But the way cars are at the moment, I we're not sure. We're just not too sure, but we really hope, really hope it comes mid June. Uh, we've been. I've been just thinking about it so much and actually You've done the setup and build, you get, yeah. yeah, which is fair enough. Those things need to be thought about. But so thank so, you. <laughs> <laughs> that's right. So we've actually already started getting gear, mm. uh, everything together we want for it. We've got fridge, tires, yeah. 12 volt, yeah. um, heaps of stuff, and it's actually all getting done in Sydney <clears throat> by a workshop called Project Overlander that's just opened up recently. So if you follow our Instagram stories, you might have noticed that a few weeks ago we were actually up there at Project Overlander just checking it out. We sat down and had a chat with Steve, the owner, who has recently opened up. They are Camp King um, outfitters, they con they sell Shieldman seats, front runner gear, so they've got heaps of stuff there as well. Yeah, Red Arc, a lot of the gear yeah. that we already work with. Yeah. So and it's Steve's just been in the fit. game for yeah. a long time. Yeah. Uh, so it's a new business in Sydney, so if you are looking at a workshop that specialises in building overland vehicles. Project Overland Arts in Western Sydney, check them out. We're well, really excited to work with yeah. a bit more of a professional for this build because obviously the past couple of builds have been a hack job by us, <laughs> which is fine. And look, you know, they it got worked. us around the country yeah. a couple of times, it worked. But, uh, you know, this time around it's a brand new car. We, wanted, we want a professional to do it. Yeah, really excited about that. So stay tuned for what the car will be. Hopefully we'll have the, you know, pick up video of us in the showroom with the ribbon Soon, on the bonnet, yeah. picking it up. So have a comment, what, what do you think it might be? Yeah. We're not going to be too cagey about it. As soon as we have it, we'll start putting videos out and a bit of a build series. Yeah. 
hopefully that won't drag on too long for you know 10 months or whatever hopefully yeah. It'll be done. And then we'll start travelling in it. And we'll start travelling. So we will answer the question straight up because people are going to be wondering what are we doing with Elsie? We're not selling her. Um, yeah. We're just going to keep her. Too many memories. I've already got plans for Elsie. Exactly. I, know, I know exactly what I want to do with yeah. her. Same and that's just money and time. So yeah. that'll come. Um, and then winter. we got a winter trip planned if this new vehicle mm. is ready or yeah. ready to a point. Uh, it might not be 100%, well, when, it, when, it, when is a vehicle 100%? But it might be ready to a point. Um, and if it is, we, yeah, hopefully sort of go west a little bit towards South Australia. Yeah. And then bang Absolutely. straight up mm -hmm. to the Kimberley, hopefully. Top end, give it a real good shakedown. Yeah. Uh, hopefully going with our mates Cam and Court for a little bit. And then also Adrian. They've all been in the videos before, but Adrian was in our Simpson videos. Yeah. Uh, and he was a pretty popular addition to the videos and he's great to travel with so yeah. hopefully yeah we'll be able to do a trip with him in his 79 and uh, yeah, it'll be a really cool couple mm. of vehicles getting around. Yeah. So yeah we're sorry for not posting more videos but obviously sometimes life gets in the way and we've just sort of got to do us for a bit and then these trips, these videos, they all cost money to produce and that's what we've been doing in the interim just you know building a business, making a nest egg, and then keeping this going on the side. Yeah. It's just, you're just gonna have to be a bit more patient. So if you're a patron, you're watching, we really appreciate your continued support. Uh, I feel a bit bad because we really haven't done anything for patrons uh, mm. for a while. Um, but it's all coming, it's all coming. It's just, things take time. Um, that being said, we kind of wanted just wanted to know, uh, what is your favorite content from us? What do you want to see? Um, because personally, I think our best content is remote travel, just traveling, camping, and showing you the places we go and filming it beautifully. Yeah. Uh, videos that come to mind, Simpson, yeah. Simpson series, Kangaroo Island, up North Queensland, uh, those kind of things. When we can take a bit more time, we're actually traveling, we're not just rushing from spot, mm. to, spot to spot. Um, that is probably the most expensive kind of videos to do. Yeah. Um, it's why I see a lot of YouTubers doing like sort of in between filler videos because they're kind of easy and cheap and meet the weekly upload sort of thing, you know, like they do a sit down talk, much like we're doing now. Um, mm -hmm. So yeah, they are the hardest videos to do, most expensive, but most rewarding. And I think people, we get the best engagement. Yeah. What do you reckon, Hal? Definitely, yeah. Yeah, you agree? Yeah. So as soon as we can do that, we will be doing that. And yeah. Uh, yeah, we're just really excited for the next phase, which is really remote travel. We'll do Canning mm. Stock, Arnhem Land, Cape, Cape, Kimberley, Deep Dive. Yeah, all the deserts. Kind of do the things we haven't done before. I suppose we've done a lot of just your normal travel, the big lap, all of that stuff that is pretty accessible, pretty easy to get to. Um, we want to, I guess, kind of push ourselves out of our comfort zone, go more remote. Yeah. Now that we've got more confidence in the way we travel as well, like we're more experienced um, for drivers, we're by no means experts. Mm. Um, you know, we're still learning, but we do have more confidence and we've got people to go with now to go to these remote places, which we'd love to take you along. Yeah. And hopefully also, um, you'll see a jump in quality again with the videos, uh, from what we've learnt with mm. our wedding videos, but also we've invested like big, big money in our gear. Like we're, we're not just rolling around with a couple of small Sony cameras now we're rolling around with commercial grade gear. Yeah. Um, you know. Which also yeah. then filters into our commercial side of the business, doing stuff for tourism, weddings, you know. Yeah, yeah. content for companies, so shooting yeah. remote for companies, um, which we're doing a few things for, so yeah, it's um, yeah, it's great. It's good, it's exciting, what's next? It's just, everything takes time. Yeah. <laughs> so, we won't keep you for too much longer, we'll probably wrap it up soon. Mm -hmm. But yeah, keep an eye on our, on our videos. We will have the uh, Outback Loop video that we're doing. It's just starting to rain now. Apparently there's gonna be <laughs> biblical rains in uh, Queensland, so could get flooded into Julia Creek or something. Yeah, we'll see how we go. <laughs> uh, but keep an eye out for these videos. Again, we're sorry, they're not, um, probably not like our normal videos because we're not camping, uh, which is also you know, a big part of our usual it videos. Is, yeah, yeah, we um, do miss out on a lot of footage, I suppose. It's general yeah. b-roll and yeah. being when you're camping, just doing your cooking yeah. and all that kind of thing, which is, you know, we're not doing that. So if you're into that content, sorry, it won't be that, yeah. but it will still be informative. And if you want to do a trip around Outback Queensland, yeah. it'll really help you of where to go and what to do. Because exactly. we've done some really cool stuff. Yeah, it's still traveling, so. 
yeah. we think it's relevant. That's how we're making vlogs for it. So, yeah. Uh, to wrap up, we've just got a few little announcements. Four drive shows we are going to this year will be 100% Sydney, Sydney and Adelaide. Yeah, we're not sure about Perth yet. It depends with, we do, I don't know, weddings and stuff. Um, and also just getting there, it depends if it's a new car, we're just working quite... It's a long way away from us, Perth, so... It is, yeah. So we would love to be there, we'll, we'll see, yeah. yeah. We'll do our best. Yeah. But definitely Sydney and Adelaide, we're really keen for Sydney because we haven't been to a Sydney show. No, it's, it's been, been called off the and... past couple of years that we've been on the show kind of loop, so yeah. yeah and it's obviously like our home state, so... Yeah, it's our home state, we want to <laughs> meet all the Sydney siders. Yeah. Uh, so that's fun, and last thing, we do have our merch still, we actually just got a new order in. Yep. Um, it's sort of we've upgraded it a little bit, I suppose. We've got more of these shirts in with whole like Overland Travelers women's shirt, but we've actually got it embroidered oh, yeah. now. Uh, we've got more Get Your Stuff for Leaving, more track over, over Comfort. Comfort. We've got rid of a few older styles that weren't selling, and we've got these ones. So, yeah, if you want to grab something, jump on. It's good fun. We'll put some links or photos of it in this video. Yeah. Uh, besides that, thank you very much for watching, and we'd love to hear your feedback. Comment below. Uh, and what you want to see from us. What yeah. do you like watching? What is your favourite content? We want to know so we can produce that for you and keep, yeah, keep Overland Travels going and having fun. Yeah. Oh. Thanks for, yeah, watching us. And we'll... Thanks for listening to this update. Mm -hmm. And we'll see you soon, hopefully with a brand new car. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs>